Equity and learning are the most critical challenges faced by school leaders in European schools. The common ground upon which the education of children in Europe is rooted is based on the ideals of fairness and inclusion for all. A strong commitment in supporting children learn and develop to the best of their abilities. School leaders improve equity in learning indirectly and most powerfully through their influence on staff motivation, commitment, relationships and working conditions. Since 2011, the European Policy Network on School Leadership has raised awareness, promoted cooperation and provided methodologies and schools for school leadership policy development across Europe. The European Policy Network on School Leadership has identified three policy goals as the most central to promote school leadership for equity and learning in all school systems across the EU. An enabling school leadership environment school leadership capacity building, research and evaluation on school leadership. An enabling school leadership environment is reflected in school autonomy, the room for flexibility and autonomy granted to school leaders for making important decisions affecting equity and learning. Distributed leadership, Practices that are enacted by everyone in the school, which help schools respond to major policy challenges. School accountability. Performance is relatively oblivious to the evaluation of other educational aims which are critical to the establishment of a more equitable school environment. The effectiveness of school leadership capacity building is reflected upon how well school leaders can adapt to their new roles, how competent they can become in co-designing and co-implementing policies for equity and learning in their school, as well as in encouraging the establishment of participative, democratic school cultures. School leadership policies should support innovative, transparent mechanisms for selecting school leaders design attractive career development opportunities and establish replacement procedures that ensure a balance between school continuity and change. School leadership policy development should establish a comprehensive evaluation system, which should be framed within widely accepted professional standards so it is consistent with the expectations on school leaders' performance. Evaluation systems should be predominantly oriented towards the improvement of school leaders' capacity to lead their schools. Targeted funding strategies can ensure the persistent systematic development and ability of different types of research data. Indicators and associated data on school leadership policy development can allow for valid and comparative analyses across European school systems. The European Policy Network on School Leadership has developed the Multimedia School Leadership Toolkit, which enables stakeholders to reflect upon, identify challenges and prioritise areas for policy action. 18 national regional action plans that aim to make school leadership for equity and learning a priority in school reform agendas and in supporting the professionalisation of the field.